You don't need formulas when you have dimensional analysis. Read this question with me. You may think we need a formula to solve this, but we don't. Take a look at the units we have in this question. We have seconds and coulombs, which are base units, and we also have joules and volts, which are SI-derived units. Here's a table reminding us what the SI units of joules and volts are. This is all we need to know to solve this question. Let's draw a conversion table now for our dimensional analysis. 12 joules can be written as 12 kilograms times meter squared over second squared. Volts can be written as kilograms times meter squared over coulombs times second squared. Notice the only difference here is the coulombs. Therefore, this table is showing us that joules divided by coulombs makes volts. Also notice the question gave us seconds, but through dimensional analysis, we can see that was a distractor term we ended up not needing at all. So all we have to do is 12 joules divided by four coulombs and get our final answer of three volts. And that is the correct answer. And that is why 